In 2015, six of the seven counties surrounding Fauquier County were accredited through the Virginia Law Enforcement Professional Standards Commission, also known as VALEPSI. Sheriff Mosier signed on to obtain VALEPSI accreditation soon after taking office on January 1, 2016. What does accreditation mean to you? Accreditation is a coveted award and not easy to come by. The process is all-encompassing and it opens up every aspect of our operation to inspection. Accreditation symbolizes professionalism and excellence. After going through the self-assessment phase and two mock assessments, the Sheriff's Office was in the final assessment phase by June 2018 and obtained full accreditation on August 9, 2018. Accreditation means that we are delivering the best, most effective, uh, and efficient law enforcement services to our community. We're always looking for ways to improve, and accreditation is a time-proven method to assist us in measuring and improving our performance. I'm proud to work at an accredited agency. It means we are providing the best public safety services and we are a progressive law enforcement agency. What does accreditation mean to you? We are utilizing the best standards and practices to protect the health and safety of inmates in our facility as well as the deputies and staff who work here. Accreditation means that when you call 911, whatever the emergency is, you can be confident that you are speaking with a professional, knowledgeable telecommunicator. After going through the self-assessment phase and two mock assessments, the Fauquier County Sheriff's Office was in the final assessment phase by June of 2018 and obtained full accreditation on August 9th, 2018. With accreditation in place, the Sheriff's Office has now standardized its operational procedures and the mission of the office for the enhancement of service to the public and establishes the professional effectiveness for the deputies. Not only did the Fauquier County Sheriff's Office pass the on-site assessment the first time around, we passed with zero major or minor infractions and no waivers, an accomplishment not previously seen by the current commission. Under the leadership of Sheriff, Sheriff Robert Mosier, that he's committed to the idea of professionalism and is exhibited by his agency and his personnel. Also committed to the service of this community and the standards of accreditation. This was evident in the static display, the agency tour. You can tell that his entire staff, from dispatcher to deputy, the civil process to the adult detention center, every single one of them were on board. Every single one of them wanted to go above and beyond to help us. You can just tell that their heart was in it. It wasn't, I was told to do this by my sheriff, so I'm going to do it. Professionalism in the sheriff's office, from support personnel to administrative staff, all the way up to the sheriff. You can tell that the sheriff demands the highest ethics and more from members under his leadership. It's obvious that he sets the example and expects the same from his employees. It was fun to watch the personalities and the way the administrative, the admin staff, and the different people mesh together. We picked up on that stuff in one of his own sites and uh, watching the way they all mesh and got along as a team. Um, when they came in the room and they, we told them kind of where they stood, they had to wait for the commission's blessing, but here's where you stand with us. You could see the glow, you could, they all started patting each other on the back. You could tell it was just a team thing. You could tell that it, it was the agency, everybody wanted it, everybody realized that. Again, on behalf of the assessors, I as a team leader would like to thank Sheriff Moser and his accreditation manager, Lieutenant Sean Lasher, and all the deputies, all the command staff of that agency for the hospitality given to us. We were truly treated um, professionally, and like I said, there was no hesitation. The doors were open for us to do anything we needed to. Okay. With that, all those in favor? Aye. All those opposed? Congratulations, sir. Takeaway that I have from um, the assessors, and the lead assessor Chris Hawkins, was the statement that he made here, and he also made it to me back in Fauquier County uh, when we had the uh, the outbrief. And it was this, quite simply this, that when he and the assessors interacted with any deputy or any employee in the organization, that they could ask questions, and there was no one hovering to to make sure that the question was answered in a certain way or not. But in fact, they were free and open to have those discussions. And that's our commitment. 
transparency, accountability, a professional organization, standards set forth by this commission that should be exemplified through all law enforcement in Virginia, in the Commonwealth. And I will do whatever I can to promote that. Just so you know, I promise that to this board. What you've just seen is a, um, an example of the men and women of the Sheriff's Office coming together uh, for a collective reason, and that is the uh, achievement of accreditation. Uh, so I uh, want to thank the men and women of the Falker County Sheriff's Office for their efforts and what we were able to achieve together. Um, also, I would like to uh, thank all of the members of the Board of Supervisors for their support and also the support of the uh, county government. So we uh, just look forward for, to the future and uh, thank you for being part of that process.